welcome to class 6 physics classes today we are doing some numericals from physical quantities and measurement exercise 2.3 okay question number 11 the length of a square room is 13 meter what is the floor area of the room okay the length of a square is given as 13 meter and it is asked the area of the room very easy question okay here you have to write given okay given that length of a square is equals to 13 meter okay the unit is meter now we know the formula to find area of a square area of a square is equals to what is equals to your side is square okay and side is here 13 meter square 13 into 13 is 169 and meter square is meter square the unit of area is meter square here so the area of the floor is 169 meter square okay question number 12 the length of a school compound is 450 meter and breadth is 145 meter find the area of compound in number a meter square and number b hectares okay now here given is length of school compound the length is given and breadth is given okay so with this length and breadth we can find the area of the compound okay this uh, school compound is in rectangular shape because length and breadth is given okay and length and breadth is not equal if it is equal then it will be of square shape these two are not equal then it means it is a rectangular shape okay so first of all let us find the area in meter square So here area of before that given let us write given is given is length is equals to 450 meter and breadth is equals to 145 meter okay so we know the formula to find the area of a rectangle is equals to length into breadth so length is 450 meter and breadth is 145 meter okay so when we multiply these two we will get the area 
that is 65,250 meter square so this is number A answer and for number B in terms of hectares okay to convert this one into hectares we have to divide it by 10,000 isn't it so let us divide it by 10,000 we know 1 meter square is equals to 1 by 10,000 isn't it hectares so this one B number we know we can write here B number answer will be area in terms of hectare this 65,250 50 meter square divided by 10,000 so here we don't have to write meter square now when we divide it by 10,000 it will become hectares okay meter square will become hectares after dividing by 10,000 so while we divide it we get 6.525 hectares okay question number 13 A district A district has a length of two twenty kilometer, okay, and breadth is seventeen kilometer. We have to find the area of district in kilometer square and in hectares okay so length is given and breadth is given of a district and we have to find the area of the district okay length and breadth both are given in kil kilometer so number a we can easily find that is area in kilometer square so first of all let us write given things given length of district is equals to 20 kilometer breadth of district is equals to 17 kilometer we know length area is equals to length into breadth this is also in rectangular shape so 20 kilometer into 17 kilometer when we multiply 340 kilometer square will get okay so this is number a answer and now b number one kilometer square is equals to 100 hectare okay this we know and then we have to convert this kilometer square is equals into hectares okay so therefore area in hectare will be 340 into 100 
okay because kilometer square is greater than hectare the unit kilometer square is greater than hectare so to convert kilometer square into hectare we have to multiply by 100 and it becomes hectare okay and the area is 34 you need 10 hundred thousand ten thousand thirty four thousand hectare okay question number 14 is a triangular cardboard is of base base is given here 20 centimeter base of a triangle is given and height from its base is 15 centimeter okay it is asked what is the area of cardboard it is very clear that the shape of the area to find is triangle okay so here given let us write from the question given our base of triangle is equals to 20 centimeter unit is in centimeter height of triangle is equals to 15 centimeter and we know the formula we know the formula to find area of a triangle is equals to half into base into height this height can be called as altitude also don't get confused half into base into height or half into base into altitude same thing so here half into base is 20 centimeter and height is 15 centimeter so when you calculate 2 ones are 2 tens are and when you multiply this you will get 150 centimeter into centimeter centimeter square so the area of this triangular cardboard is 150 centimeter square Question number 15 A coin of radius when it is given radius that means we are working on circle 28 millimeter what is the area in a millimeter square and in b centimeter square okay so we are working in circle it's given here radius is equals to 28 millimeter so given radius of coin is equals to 28 millimeter now we have to find the area and we know the formula to find area of a circle is area is equals to pi r square the value of pi is 22 by 7 this you have to remember okay so here putting the value of pi 22 by 7 and putting the value of r r is 28 28 millimeter square r square okay now just expand it 22 by 7 28 millimeter into 28 millimeter 7 and this will cancel 7 4 times is 28 and when you multiply 22 into 4 into 28 you are going to get 2400 64 millimeter square so number a 
and so we have got that is the area of the coin in millimeter square is this much and for number b we have to convert it into centimeter square so the relation of millimeter square and centimeter square is 1 millimeter square is equals to 1 by 100 centimeter square this is the relation between millimeter square and centimeter square so to convert this area this area into centimeter square what we have to do millimeter square is smaller than centimeter square so when smaller units becomes bigger units we have to divide okay so we have to divide this area 2464 by 100 to get it in centimeter square so 24.64 centimeter square is the area of that coin in terms of centimeter square so this is number b okay thank you very much